This bizarre stone is relatively new on our planet, and we're going to learn about it. Cool school comic clip time! This is Plastiglomerate, and it was discovered on a remote beach back in 2006. Let's learn about it. Today we're heading to the second widest state in the United States known for its beautiful beaches and laid-back lifestyle, Hawaii. Our journey begins at the southeastern corner of the Big Island, Camilo Beach. Now, Camilo Beach is very remote, and the only way you can get there is traving on a dirt road. It used to be renowned for the amounts of driftwood that it would collect, but nowadays it's collecting something different. Plastic. Lots and lots of plastic. But I just said it's a remote beach, right? Where did all this plastic come from? A few hundred kilometers north of the Hawaiian Islands floats a mass collection of marine debris called the Great Pacific Garbage Patch. This trash vortex spins the garbage in a clockwise motion and Camilo Beach lies right in its path. People who love this beach have been putting in a great deal of effort to try and clean it up and keep it clean. And it really does look a lot better. Even with all the beach cleanup, it's still really hard to tackle the giant problem of tiny plastics. The finest grains of sand have microplastic. And that's where a plastiglomerate comes in. Plastiglomerate is formed when a heat source melts the plastic debris. That melted plastic oozes in between the cracks and crevices of the rocks in the sediment, gluing it together to form what scientists have called a Frankenstein rock. Scientists say it is likely formed by fires lit by humans, but anywhere where there is a heat source, if plastic debris is nearby, it could form. Some samples look like mine, and other samples have giant pieces of plastic inside. Is plastiglomerate even a rock? Is it part of the rock cycle? Whatever the case, the rate we're going with our plastic usage, it's here to stay. And there'll be different types of plastic glomerate all over the planet. Check out the Cool School comic website to learn more about rocks and all sorts of other cool science.